Hey YouTube, what's up? So, you know, I was kind of thinking though, motivation though. Young guys, we have this energy though, and we just want to work out, work out, work out. And then after a while, we just kind of think it to ourselves, we're like, alright, we worked out this long and stuff, but, you know, either something's not going right, or whatever, or, you know, like, uh, we're not getting enough credit or certain attention that we want. And it's like we fall back on some other things. And you, then you kind of realize that when you see old guys do it, though. When I was out of run today, though, just jogging, you know, by the park. I, now, you, now you see my videos that I like to do push-ups and pull-ups and stuff like that. I saw this old guy, you know, ripped as hell. He wasn't very big. He was very, He could have been like... And from the distance from my eyes, he could have been anywhere from like 5, 10 to 6 feet, you know. Give or take maybe like 5, 11. Somewhere around like my dad's height. Could have been 185, 190 pounds. Muscle. Just solid muscle though. All he had on was like black sweats and a uh, white beater uh, tank top shirt, you know. And he was just started doing pull-ups like 1, 2, 3, 4. And then I kind of noticed he started getting on the ground and starting push-ups, push-ups. And I realized that <coughs> that's what I want in a way of life, you know. I want to be that old guy that, you know, people look and say, that, that old man, damn he's ripped. I'm pretty, and, and also have them say, you know, I wouldn't want to fuck with him. Either. You know, if, he was in a, if I were to get in a fight with him. Uh-uh, I'd go back the other way, man. <laughs> you know? And th that's really the thing, though. It's to inspire others, plant something in them, then make them do good, and then they do good. Just like the chain reaction. And that's what I'm pretty sure that's what a lot of people do, though. You know? Now, yeah, I've had, you know, certain bad habits, you know, of course, like drinking and stuff, but... Generally, overall, though, I want to go in the right direction of getting of get, getting people to stop being so negative on those that are working hard. You know, like when of course after I saw the guy running, not running, doing uh, pull-ups and push-ups at the park, though I was running, of course, running by Marta's top. And, um, of course, having uh, my short shorts on and just a t-shirt. Guy was like, hey, faggot, nice shorts running. And I, and I swear, you know, some, some fucking asshole that I swear, like, doesn't deserve to breathe oxygen or anything. Just said that as I was running it by. And I'm, like, thinking, what the hell? What kind of ad? Like, that's what I want to disappear, though, you know? I want to set good examples. And, you know, when I run and stuff, I share it, like, on my Facebook and, and, you know, Twitter. And, I mean, I give about that much attention. That much attention. So little. It only is if um, I post pictures, though. Now, if I post pictures of me running, I get a shitload of attention, which is good. But, you know, but, like, constantly, like, certain, like, every day, you know, when nothing's... Going big and, you know, you're just searching through your Facebook and yada, yada, yada. And just nothing important. I usually just write down what I'm doing it, but it's, I don't know. It just seems to get past people. Just psh. But I guess, I don't know, maybe that's how people are or something. But I want to get rid of that, you know. That attitude and stuff. That guy, you know, that piece of shit. I told me, hey, faggot, nice shorts, as I was running by him on a martyr stop. Instead of him saying that, he's like, good job, man, good job. That's it, you know? You didn't have to go and say something else to get me mad. But, I mean, I, I still just ran. I didn't stop or anything. But in the back of my mind, I'm like, what a piece of shit, you know? I hate people like that. They either need to change their thinking, you know, completely around, do a 180, or get out completely, you know? Punch your ticket the way out, man, you know? 
It would be a much better world without people like that here. It's either change your thinking or just get out. Punch your ticket out. I know it's just some brutal, frank, harsh and stuff, but that is my honesty, though. But I was very excited, though, to see that old man. And that's what I want to do. I want to be, you know, like, let's say if I live up to being my 90s, which yesterday was my grandpa's 95th birthday, though. 90 freaking five, even though he smoked and drank a lot of years, but it's just crazy, he's still living. But, to be, to be able to live up old age and still do things that, you know, people that would be younger than me at that time would have difficult doing, I'll be like, I swear, if I live up to be 90 and I'm doing something, and there's some guy or something who's 45, and he's saying, no, this is hard, I mean, whatever, if I'm working with him, if I'm competing against him or something, I really want to say, hey, man, shut the fuck up. I'm twice your age and I'm doing this. Quit being a pussy, man. Up. That's what I would say to him. Maybe it would change his thought and thinking and, it'll, and, you know, with me having to say really bad stuff to him in a way... It could ignite something in his head to turn it positive so he could stop complaining and, you know, and start doing good and start actually doing stuff and improving his life. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, that's why I've been doing the push-ups, you know, constantly with the running and, yeah, just talking about that. Which, by the way, though, I'm, I'm going to post a video soon about doing pull-ups, so. You know, that's another good exercise. It's constantly doing pull-ups, pull-ups, pull-ups. And I'm also going to get back with the uh, recaps on the track, though. Probably get all of them by either tomorrow or Sunday. One of those two. So, anyways, uh, yeah, it's a long video. And I'm just constantly yada, 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 talking. But I just wanted to get it out there, you know. Set a good example, though. Especially someone younger than you is looking, though. You know, that's why when I become a parent, I want to make sure, especially like if I'm at my house doing any kind of workout, that my kids, they see me, I'm going all out completely. And they'll be like, Dad, look at Daddy, he's doing push-ups and something like that, you know? Or, you know, like when I get older, instead of my grandkids saying, oh, Grandpa needs his medication again, oh, well, let's, go, let's go visit Grandpa at the... At the nursing home or something. No, I I would rather have my grandkids say, "Damn, grandma kicked, uh, grandpa kicked my ass again in the 5K." And I was training. He's like, "Ah, pff. he just, pff. I just ran. Ah, you know, just be this old grumpy guy that would still kick, you know, like uh, pe uh, people's asses who are like 65, 70 years younger than I am. Oh, that would be, that would be awesome. That's what I want out of life. I don't want to be rich." famous, I don't have all this abundance of money, no, I just want to be that old guy, you know, that's setting good examples when I'm out there doing something, people noticing and be like, you know what, this guy, this guy's a good person, you know, he's, I mean, whatever he's doing, keep it up, he's not giving up, I want to be that guy, you know, I don't want to be the other guy who's in a wheelchair, who has to use a cane, who's breathing through some ventilator tube to help him assist, you know, it's like, you know, just, no, I, I want to be strong, healthy, still be able to do stuff, still be enthusiastic, have this great vitality, and just go, you know, when I'm like 95, or heck, even if I live up to be 100, you know, I'll be 2087 if I live up to be 100, though. I, that's a long time away, you know, so I'm thinking about it, yeah, that's, that's, that's a little, that's 75, well, I'll be 26 later this year, so I'll be, you know, 74 years away, <laughs> but I, you never know, I mean, I've, I am coming back a little bit on the bad habits, so I'm not gonna, like, constantly drink a lot of them, but I'm still gonna have a beer or two every now and then, though, I'd rather have it, you know, like, celebrations and stuff. You know, yeah, reward myself, though. Because I don't want to be all stressed out and like, well, constantly, you know, I'm doing this and I'm trying to do good. But 
the same time, you know, it's like, I, I kind of want to have, like, a damn beer or a freaking cake or cookie once in a while, you know? So just be happy, you know, and, and know that I'm doing good. And when people notice that, that's going to make me feel even better and continue to want, continue to do it more and just have that chain reaction grow and grow and grow and grow more. Yeah. So, <laughs> don't for me blabbing, but hey, you know, just, uh, saying it all loud all on this camera though that's pretty much my whole entire thing the whole reason in a way I mean I started YouTube just because a lot of people did I was just talking about blah 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 but as I'm doing as I post more and more videos this is like the most important video period that I think I'm gonna post in a very long time I don't know Maybe till tomorrow, <laughs> or maybe not for like another few more years. You know, life is just crazy. Sometimes you just never know what's gonna happen. But uh, that's 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 my goal. That it, that's my whole goal in life. You know, like I said before, I don't want to be famous, rich, you know, abundance of money. No, I just want to set good examples, live up to be old age, see people who are younger than me, noticing what I'm doing. And I was saying that I don't give up at, on anything and I just continue fighting on moving forward and I just want to just do that and have people get inspired by that and and follow well I mean lead good examples by looking at me and they're like all right I'm gonna do that or you know do something similar but something good that'll help others as well yeah that sums up all the, the freaking almost 12 minutes of the yadding I've been talking about. So, till then, peace.